Okay, and another thing that came out of that dumpster was this little baby here. This um, is a uh, Presario CQ56. You know, it looks like a pretty reasonable laptop. I mean, it's seen some better days, but it um, doesn't look like it's too badly worse for wear. And uh, it doesn't have an adapter, um, but um, let's see if it, uh, if it powers up. Huh, sure enough. Huh. Sure enough. Well, didn't catch the uh the BIOS. Yeah, well, that doesn't sound like a happy sound. Well, let's try that again. Okay. Okay, yeah. Goes into the BIOS. Very nice. Uh no, that's not arrow keys. F1. Uh, what is in here? An AMD V140. 2.3 gigahertz and 2 gigs of RAM. Eh. It's old and slow, but it's, you know, it's like I've got desktop systems that are um, about that vintage that I'm still using. I mean, for things like, uh, you know, streaming music. Um, that kind of thing, or just as, you know, browsing the web. Not going to be editing video on it or anything like that, but, uh, but anyways, yeah. So yeah, that just came out of the, uh, the garbage. Essentially. Um, I'm going to see if I can put, what do we have here? Yeah, Ubuntu 1404. Let's see if we can put Ubuntu on it. Um, wait, does it have a hard disk? I shouldn't, I should check that first of all. Uh, internal notebook hard drive. Well, it looks like it's got a hard drive. Um, if it didn't, I think it would have an exclamation mark outside it, but let's, uh, let's see if we can do that. Okay, so let's see if we can get this thing to boot from a DVD. Ah, look at that. She's a booting up from the DVD. Looks like we're going to have some success here. I will um, stop recording here and then we will uh, I'll record some more when I get more information. So, heck yeah, there it is. Um, boots off of C CD slash DVD. So let's see what happens when we try Ubuntu on this thing. On a AMD RS 880. Hmm, I'm not even sure what that actually means, but uh, we've got 913 megabytes on. No, 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 no. That can't be right. Oh, yeah. Love that idea. Huh. Okay, let's install Ubuntu on it. So, there we go. Installing Ubuntu. We'll see if this thing boots up after it's done installing. Okay, installation's finished. Let's click restart. And there it is. Booting up with Ubuntu 16.04 on it. So, yeah. Um... It's another laptop. It's probably the same vintage as the uh, as the tablet that um, I found in the dumpster, but um, you know, it seems to be perfectly um, perfectly good for you know the kind of things I'm going to be using it. I'll try and install Dronin on it, and it will be become my remote flight controller. Although the battery doesn't seem to last very long, but I mean, ah, to be expected. I might get a new battery for it. I don't know. Anyways. That was a good score.